Dan Perkins, Jasper County Cover Crop Guy. It's April 15th, and we're in northwest Indiana, Jasper County. And here we are revisiting the plots that we seeded about eight different cover crop species onto soybeans just as they were starting to yellow. And here we're looking at um, mainly cereal rye, triticale, and annual ryegrass um, that made it through and then the blank spots so this was just kind of a a little demo plot for this farmer to see the different cover crop species and how they grew in a simulated aerial seeding so here we are in the spring and we can see that the cereal rye annual ryegrass and then this plot in here had some hairy vetch although it's rather thin and this again was seeded September 18th so rather late actually. Um, I think the going uh, theme for us in this area and what we're learning is that if we can go earlier, 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 we are gonna get much better stands and much better success. But how early is too early? So this fall 2015 will be seeding in August 15th, August 30th, and then September, um, first week in September where it's typical for aerial seeding into corn and beans around here. So this is something that you can do easily on your own farm. I just took a hand spinner and spun it on, walked along the edge, uh, marked out my little map, and now I can come back and revisit this, um, and this is what made it. So Dan Perkins, Cover Crop Guy, making cover crop work for you.